Hi, I'm Blake McGowan and I'm a certified professional ergonomist with Human Tech. Passive static stretching is something commonly done prior to and during physical work activities. The perceived benefits of this stretching is increased range of motion as well as reduced risk of injury. Now just as a reminder, passive static stretching really just lengthens the muscle to a point that is kind of slightly uncomfortable and then they hold it there for about 10 to 15 seconds. So how does this type of stretching impact uh, human performance? And remember, ergonomics is all about optimizing human performance. Well, in 2013, Evan Peck, MD, from, and a group of researchers from the Mayo Clinic and the Cleveland Clinic did a really nice review of the literature to understand the impact of stretching on human performance. So what did they find? Well, first they found that stretching actually reduces strength capabilities or your ability to generate force. Second, stretching reduces your speed and agility. And thirdly, stretching really doesn't have any impact on your muscle endurance. So it doesn't either help or hurt. So what does this mean? What's the bottom line? The bottom line is that passive static stretching actually decreases human performance. Of most importance though, it actually decreases your strength capability or your ability to generate force. Good news though is there's other studies that show the same thing. In 2013, Simic and his colleagues did a meta-analysis of 104 different studies to figure out the impact of uh, static stretching on force generating capabilities and they found the same thing. And they basically said that static stretching should ge generally be avoided. So for more information on HumanTech and our position statement on stretching, please feel free to visit us at humantech.com. Thanks, have a great day.